Today, we're going to our friend's house to see their new baby bunnies. You might remember our friends, David and Ken. A couple months ago, Daniel and little buddy went to their place to to participate in their uh, efforts to get their rabbits to breed. They have these really great silver fox rabbits. And the gestation period is 30 days. So two months later, why are we going to see the baby rabbits? Well, it didn't work the first time. So Dave figured it out about a month ago and, uh, and the second time it worked. And the new baby bunnies have just been born. So we're gonna go check them out. They look really weird now. It's really cute. <laughs> How old are they? Uh, they're they were what four weeks on Friday. Yeah. yeah. We're we're putting them outside to kind of get them used to the cold. They're gonna go in the coop probably tomorrow or the next day. I got a little broody section nice. set up in there and just let the other chickens get used to them and yeah. then we'll integrate them in about a week or two. Yeah, that's but nice. But I tell you, these little guys or girls, uh -huh. uh, we bought. Um, what are these called? Uh, leggings, white leggings. Oh yeah, yeah. They they are so freaking friendly. Yeah, they're, they're really good layers too. Yeah, they're, they're just they're the best. And they lay white eggs, I think. Yeah, yeah. yeah I great. think I think mostly like large, extra large white eggs. Yeah, that's great. So how old are these plants? Uh, they're they're a little over four weeks, like four weeks and four days, something like that. Yeah. 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 All these guys want to do is eat. Everything they said is true about them. <laughs> so now we need to, because we can see our garden again. Yeah. <laughs> so we need yeah. to put in some low tunnels and feral rats. Big. Yeah, she's a she's a big healthy girl. She's probably 10, 11 pounds, something like that. Okay, I can't wait to see. And that's that's the dad. He's he's a little smaller. Yeah, that's okay. He's pretty shy though. Both of these rabbits really don't like to be handled too much, but, mm. um, yeah. So how old are the kits now? Five days. Yeah, five days. And last, I haven't checked them in a couple of days, but when they were first born, I mean, they were just, they were like so tiny. And when I checked them a few days ago, they'd already doubled in size. Wow. So, but they've, they've been fine so far. That's good. I hope. We'll see. This is the mother's name? Um, Female. It was, yeah, it was Tina. Yeah. There was uh, Ike and Tina Turner. <laughs> That's funny. All right, Mama. Come here. Don't so, what indicators did you see leading up to her having her litter that let you know that let you know that she was pregnant and about to give birth and all that? Well, number one, she just looked really huge. You could see her belly was a lot bigger. Uh, she was laying on her side a lot instead of sitting up, and you could kind of see her belly. And I thought I saw some movement too, but sometimes that's the digestion going on. It's, it's oh, hard to right. tell. Uh, but I did get my hand on her and I was trying to feel, I could feel a little bit of movement. So, um, but about five days before she had the babies, she was running around with hay in her mouth, trying to make nests everywhere. And she'd, she'd build a nest, destroy it, build another one, destroy it. And then when I put the box in there, um, she got it all situated and ready and it was pretty much done. We were just kind of nice. waiting. Yeah. Goodness. There they are. Oh. <laughs> How many are there? There's seven. Seven? There's five black ones. Wow. And then you can see right here these ones that are look kind of gray. I guess they, they call them blues. Oh. But they'll yeah. well, as can they get older that? their fur will be nice and blue. But uh see they like hop when you touch yeah. them. They think it's uh mama coming in to feed them, so they're oh. fighting for a teat there. They're so little. Yeah, you see his little uh, teeth there? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh. 
So their eyes are still closed. Yeah, they'll usually about 10 days, their eyes will open up and they'll kind of come out here and explore a little. Wow, it's they're okay, so nice Mama. and warm in there. I don't want them to get cold. Yeah. No, they'll be fine. They do surprisingly <laughs> well in the cold. They're so cute. Yeah, I'll just move that over if you want there. Get a better look at them. Low bummy hop. So cool. Ah. Like, hopefully she gets a little better, you know. Um, oh, I'm a little concerned that mm -hmm. she they all, they don't walk had rabbits. the kids outside. Oh, they? This very softly. Very softly. What do you think, little buddy? No, it looks soft. You're soft. Not too soft. Yeah, it's very soft. Just soft enough, right? When were they going to grow up? Yeah, we're in the next couple of months. They'll get a lot bigger. Oh, he just peed on me. Oh, okay. Oh. It's okay. <laughs> Jackpot. Lucky you. All right. I'm done. <laughs> I'll go wash my hands. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> they, thought your, they thought your finger was a teat, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, little monkeys. Oh, look at them bellies. Look how fat they are. Nice. Yeah. That's a good, healthy little kit. Yeah, they're at least double the size already. And getting furry. Wow. Yeah, he just peed in my hand too. It's warm. <laughs> Bonus. I don't think it's there's anything softer than this right here. If there is, I've never felt it. The oversized nest box that just barely fits through the door. Are all seven gonna be for me, actually, well, there's one that I guess you're going to give to us, but uh, yeah. if you could just talk about what your plans are for the seven. And... Um, well, one's for you, yes, and uh, I've got a couple of people that want them um, for meat, and I'm actually going to trade one or two of these off. I found a, a Rex breeder, a standard Rex, that will just trade for some of their kits that they have. They're looking for Silver Fox, I'm looking for some Rex, so. Cool. Yeah, and whatever I can't get rid of, they'll, they'll go in the freezer, unless there's a really good one I want to keep over for a breeder. I might do that too, so we'll see how they turn out. She's a little upset. We had a great time with David and Kim and their little rabbits, and we even got to hold them. One of the tiny rabbits actually may have relieved himself on my hand, but he was super soft and super cute, and David has offered us one of their uh, one of their silver fox does when they're a little bit bigger. We would love to breed her with our um, with our mini rex to get some nice little rex.